All right, guys, I am over here at Streetsboro. It's actually a DHL facility, but the customer is uh, Nestle. So putting in a little bit more steps this morning before my load. My appointment was at 930 and got down here and they hadn't even started on loading the trailer it was in the hole or in the door but had not been started yet so they're working on it right now an hour later we're still waiting flash what feels good out here the red light so as soon as that turns green I'll be able to hook up and rock and roll up out of here hit the Kentucky delivering down there at Kroger yesterday I dropped off here this is the same location that I dropped and they had uh 42,000 pounds of mac and cheese. So, let me get over here before I get ran over. But, just getting some steps in. So when I'm finished, I'll be going over here to the guard shack, which they had the paperwork. And that's, uh, I'll seal the trailer up and this weather but I'm gonna jump off here and I'll see you again in Kentucky
I made it here to Kentucky. I'm about 30 miles from uh, 90. Um, but they don't have overnight parking, so it's getting late. And parked it here at um, Newcastle, Kentucky. Actually, quite a bit of spots left uh, for as late as it is. But I found that if you're really in the Kentucky area, that, that I ain't gonna say parking's not a problem, but it's not as big of an issue as other places. Like if you were to go to Illinois or uh, Ohio or a lot of different other states, parking's already been filled up by four or five o'clock. So, just glad to get one. Here's a little picture of the scenery here. And uh, I'm gonna go in here and use the restroom and I'll catch back with you here shortly.